Rhyme Bell is now online. Hey guys and girls, I recently got a comment asking to know how to make a click counter. So here we go. As always, you want to start off with a HTML tag and close it down below. Following that, inside your HTML tag, open up a body tag and close it also. Once that is out of the way, now we can make our button. This button is going to be used to call our count function. In between your button tags, you can display a text here. As for me, I'm just going to call it click. Below our button tag, we're going to display our counting text. We can do this using an empty paragraph tag. When you're done with that, we can go on to JavaScript. To do this, we just open up a script tag. Easy as that. We're going to start this off by opening up a variable tag. This is going to be named count, and this count variable is going to be inclusive of a function which adds one whenever we click our button. Remember the button we made? Well, we're going to use a function in this function. So what we're going to do is to display our count variable inside this function. That's so functional. Ha 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 ha. <laughs> You see that count function? Yeah, that's what I was talking about. Don't forget to save. Like, literally, just don't. Just, just don't forget. Save. When you open it up, you should see a button with a text. And when you click on it, you notice it doesn't work. Why? Because but the D and ID is supposed to be lowercase, so let's go back and fix it. Now if you refresh your page, whoa, it actually works. It counts? What? How's your computer that smart? It can count? Oh my gosh. Yo, and that's how to do it guys. Now until next time, Rhyme Bell out.